that's okay. We are now in Grand Falls to get Pound Cake and the one who is the winner is currently Shogi. Yeah. Shogi, I believe, has been using all Robin today as well, so. That is true. I don't know exactly how close Winner's Finals was because I did not was not able to see that set. But I do know that there's a reputation for some of these sets to be really quick. Some of these sets to be really convincing for Shogi, I have seen. And then there have other you know, other times where Pound Being able to take off two sets in a row for Pound Cake though, I really wonder, is that off? Up tilt, sure you that's the first stock. Pound Cake already taking the first stock in the set. That's looking, that's promising for that, for that story. I like that movement too, dodging out of the way with the focus. Did I think I watched that set? Actually, was I here for Winter Smiles? Yeah, I did see that set. Okay. I just don't remember it very well. But regardless, you're in the present. Not past. Past is a good thing to reflect on for the present, though. Avoids that down are very well timed. I'm starting to recall the ending of that set now. I think this one fat was a 3-0 and Shaky's favorite, but the way this is looking, this could go either way so far, I feel like. My god. <laughs> Shogi takes game one with the book toss. Considering all the zoning options that Robin has, having something like that is actually really good because it's a fast moving projectile that kills that goes a really long distance too. So Shogi's able to take the first game with the book toss. Good utilization of his tool. Of his, all of his resources. Right, game two it is. This string from Shogi takes six, Pound Cake taking 68%. What a beautiful punish. Good forward smash, sending Ryu out there. Very good awareness to not let that Arc Thunder, or that Hell Thunder, sorry. Hell Thunder trap him off stage there, using his own Hadoken to bat it out instead. And he finds a really good punish right there off that opening off of the off of the downer approach. This is such a dumb character. <laughs> That's actually so dumb. Holy! <laughs> uh, they just both laugh it off. They both laugh it off. Sure, you can out of his son. Why not? You know. Pound Cake finding himself some good damage here. Punish on the landing. Up air, yes, 56%. Downer? No, he does not find it. Able to prevent the spiking hit of Elwyn from knocking him down, though. And able to avoid that checkmate, too, but focusing. Shogi reading the approach into the stage. He finds the stock. Very nice. Pound Cake's playing, playing to the platforms as his approach, main approach, I feel like. I'm, not, I'm noticing. That's it! Wow! Okay. Counter Shory. Counter Shory can. 1 1. But yeah, Pound Cake was using. Um, approaching from the platform to Shogi, and he was doing it in a really good way. That I was able to avoid the zoning that Shogi was trying to do to throw out there. I think that was just more of a mistake on Shogi's part, trying to cover or trying to keep him out, but making it really easy for Pound Cake to get in. I feel, yeah. 
He left, he left himself really open. But Shogi is a very is a very wise player as he gets does and learn from his mistakes very well. It's game three here. Punishes, dragging him all the way to the other side and continuing the combo, stuffing him out with down tilt. I really like that. The F tilt too. Very good pressure on Power King Spark here. That's a short you can add death. Cross up roll. Gets behind the arc bar. Robin is really, really easy to punish up close from behind too. Especially if he's uh, in the arc bar leg as you saw there. That's definitely going to do it from. Grab. Downer. No way. He totally went for it too. Had the right read. That is going to do right there. Hard charge on the down smash. He does find the roll in the pound cake he's looking for that time, that last time. Pound cake's not been able to do as much pressure on the second stop. Shogi's kept him out really well. Kept him in a really disadvantageous spot to get a lot of damage off. Very good focus play. Your center stage is knocked away. Nope. Ryu has the book, just tosses it away. He doesn't need a book when he has Shoryuken. So he has no art fire, but he does get his Thunder Best book back, so can use that again. He gets his art fire back too. The animation baited the approach. He actually got the stock of art fire up here. I'm, I'm, <laughs> right. Shogi one game away from taking this whole tournament. Game number four of this Grand Finals. Counting City. The classic, you're gonna die early off the top to sure you can. And you can die really early off the top too on that middle problem too, right? Fire placement, really good. He could finish the stock here. He does not. That air dodge allows Pounder to knock away the backer. But Shogi's still putting so much pressure. That knockback angle was terrible. Oh my gosh. Shogi one stock away now. And he finds the beautiful punish. Does not finish it off. But that is really good to optimize. And it sets up for the other fire so you can get even more damage off of it too. With a successful footstool. Yeah. Alright, Fry Clanks with that though. Let's do it. This input sure you can gonna eat some damage here. Shogi trying to follow up with the arc fire to drop to finish off his punish. Does not find it here, but he gets the air dodge read, and that's it. 69% to end the tournament off, and Shogi takes it 3-1.